He was a perfect specimen of health, physically fit in his mid-50s because his work and all his hunting and fishing involved a significant amount of physical activity. But this early morning, he woke with an uncomfortable chest pressure going into his neck and jaw. He arose to find no relief with stretching, a glass of milk, or anything. Finally, after arousing his wife, they made their way to an emergency room where he was given a merciful pain relief and immediately tested to define if it was his heart that was causing the pain. Not long after arriving, awaiting the test results, and as his wife was talking with him, he suddenly slipped into unconsciousness. It was there on that cold midwinter South Dakota pre-dawn hour that he died, despite all the best resuscitation efforts of the emergency room team. Likely due to an arterial blockage and an irritable heart muscle, the symmetry of his heart rhythm had changed into one of pure chaos that wasn't effectively pumping blood, and he just wouldn't be converted back to normal again despite every effort. The value of rhythm is never more evident than during a cardiac arrest. The definition of rhythm comes from Greek roots of rhythmos to flow and rhyme, meaning any regular, recurring, pulsing, a succession of contrasting elements occurring over various periods of time. Think of the rhythmic experience from some speech and verse rhyme and song, drum and dance. There's something about rhythm that calls for symmetry. And when it's out of sync, there is a part of us that becomes uncomfortable and we're left wanting to make it right again. It is interesting that the rhythm of walking, running gait, of breaking waves on beach, or of heart beat pulse all match common musical rhythms of the Beach Boys, Beatles, Blake Shelton, Beyonce, B.B. King, Simon and Garfunkel, Smokey Robinson, Stan Getz, The Supremes, Taylor Swift, and Benny Goodman. You pick the musical style and that life-sustaining beat is there. The rhythm of life is regular, recurring, pulsing, a succession of elements over time like the flow of seawater, fish, and animals with ocean eating shore on an estuarial tide. The seasonal swim of salmon up a freshwater river looking for a place to spawn. The birth of lambs and calves bursting forth on an early springtime prairie pasture or a protected manger. Or even the 80 to 90 year life cycle search of humans moving with joy, sorrow, and grace from birth to natural death. So when a man dies too early, the rhythm is disturbed, the symmetry is out of sync, and we're left wanting to make it right again.